Then a herald cried aloud, To you it is commanded, O people. So imagine, just like I was saying, on a higher dimension, how this will manifest through the whole world when somebody that will look just like everybody is expecting Jesus to look because of the images that they have made in Christianity, somebody will appear and there will be a body made of flesh, but they will use holograms. As for instance, um, a lot of us, I think, have heard or read regarding the Project Blue Beam. If not, please go and do so. Project Blue Beam is going to be a weapon that they will use for everybody to end up worshiping the image of the beast. So there will be a human body made of flesh for the spirit of Lucifer. But using that image, they will make a hologram and put it in the clouds in the main cities of the world. So everybody will see the, that image and will believe that it is the Almighty manifesting. That's why everywhere at the same time, during that moment with the Project Blue Beam, they have the technology to send pretty much thoughts to your mind. It would be a sending audio with the frequency of the human thought. So to people, he will be speaking to their hearts straight to them through their thoughts that's how they will uh, take it and i'm saying all of this because there's enough evidence that that exists that they can do it and that they have done it in certain places with certain people in different times in history well uh, our close history like a couple decades or maybe a little bit more but in the past decades they have used that technology to fool people um into speaking like for instance one there's a story about a muslim who got caught, he was in jail, he was being tortured, he wouldn't speak, he wouldn't speak, he wouldn't speak, until they used a hologram, and that hologram entered the, the prison and claimed to be Allah, and told him to speak, and next day he was saying everything, because he thought that was Allah appearing to him. So, they have used this technology, they were close to use it in Cuba, you can also uh, investigate that, it would be great. Uh, there is a, also a interview in which a person of the government was speaking about it and how they were about to make the second coming of Jesus happen in Cuba to make everybody fall for what they were uh, expecting to do but that is such a huge event that they decided to uh, not use it until a specific moment in history which will be when they present the false messiah so it's very important they will use holograms to show that image in the heavens then he will appear somewhere in flesh but first through a hologram in the heavens in the sky through in the clouds who will speak to them in their own language in their heads or hearts and they will believe that it is the, it is the almighty that's why it's also written that if yahweh didn't shorten the days even the chosen few will be fooled by what will happen because he will he will be such an event that if the chosen few are not saved by Yahweh in him and him shortening the time they themselves would follow, uh, follow this false Messiah because it's going to be the best Hollywood show that they have ever made